Our health and well-being are increasingly dependent on the health and well-being of our planet. And because the planet is mostly ocean, therefore the sea is critical to our health and well-being. And you would think that this is something that would be really obvious. But for so many people, the sea is a source of a sumptuous meal or a place to go and sit in the sun. And most of us don't really think of it as an integral part of our lives. So this book that I was so fortunate to be able to write is another kind of cross-disciplinary collaboration. It combines hard science, lyric writing, and photography as a way of inviting people to reframe how we consider the ocean so we will not be stranded on the shore of our ignorance. So this is the um, Great Barrier Reef. The growth rate is already declining there between 1990 and 2005 that there was a 14% decline in growth rate for some of the coral on the Great Barrier Reef. Now, why does this matter? A question I get asked a lot. Coral is only 1% of the ocean, but it represents 25% of the diversity. In the United States, that's $30 billion for the economy every year in fishing, tourism. And when we are, our economy is in trouble, um, decimating a renewable resource seems crazy. Coral reefs are also our newest and possibly best frontier for medicine for diseases whose cures now elude us. The best promise for a new antibiotic to treat antibi antibiotic resistant MRSA staph infections is coming from a biofilm on a sponge that grows on a coral reef. Our best non-addictive painkillers are coming from the venom of cone snails. There's 700 cone snails that live on coral. Scientists have only looked at four so far, and they found a number of drugs just from these four. So coral is going to be very, very important to us. I guess I would just like to point out that some of the solutions to, gl to global warming, like big reflectors in the sky, um, or pumping more dioxide into the ocean, or simulating a volcano and putting raining sulfur all over the planet may affect temperature, but they are not going to affect acidity. So thank you very much.